Hello everyone, welcome back to another very useful and informative video. In this video, I'll show you if you're trying to download any app on your iPhone device from App Store and you're having this problem. This Apple account has not yet been used in the iTunes Store, so how you can easily fix this problem and how you can download any app from App Store on your iPhone or iPad device after updating your iPhone device to the latest version iOS 18. So now let's get started how you can fix this problem. So here just simply tap on review. So after that here you will have to wait for a few moments, it's processing. So here you will have to select your country or in where you are link. Here I am going to select my own country, you will have to select your country. Then after that here you will have to again wait for a few minutes. So after that here you will have to turn on the terms and conditions. Then after that here you will have to tap on next. So after that here it's processing you will have to again wait for a few minutes. So here it's asking me to enter for the payment method. If you don't want to enter your payment method then here you can easily select none. Then after that here you will have to enter your billing address. You can also enter fake one if you don't want to enter your original one. Then here you will have to enter your city name. Then here you will have to enter the zip code of your city. If you don't know the zip code of your city, then you can check from Google. Then after that here you will have to enter your mobile phone number. If you don't want to enter your mobile phone number, you can also enter fake one. So after that here again tap on next. So here you will have to tap on continue. So now let's get started how you can download app then tap on get. Then again tap on install then here you will have to enter your Apple ID password. Then again tap on sign in. So here you can see that here you will have to tap on here. So here you can see that the app is being downloaded on iPhone device without any problem. So in this way if you are having this type of problem on your iPhone device you are not able to download any app from App Store then here in this way you can easily fix this problem if you are having this type of issue on your iPhone or iPad device. So that's it from this video hopefully you like this video. if you. If you like this video then please subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon so that you can get my all upcoming videos. Thanks for watching this video.